Hey guys, what's up? If you're watching this video for the Snowfall skin, yes, you're on the right spot. As we all know, like season 4 was there in Fortnite 5, 6, and now we are going through season 7, ladies and gentlemen. And every season, there is always a free skin, a secret skin in Fortnite, meaning the secret skin which is unlocked after week 7. Yes, we were able to unlock the secret skin after season 4, 5, 6, 7, and all these seasons, like we were able to unlock the secret skin after week 7 and in the beginning of week 8. But in this season, things have been delayed. The dates have been shifted from week 7 to week 9. So yes, ladies and gentlemen, basically you get this free skin or the secret skin after you come complete certain challenges for certain weeks and once you're done completing all those challenges you will be eligible to unlock the skin for yourself it's super easy super simple so for this season we had to unlock like 60 weekly challenges we had to complete 60 weekly challenges to get the secret skin now that is not possible because every week we have like only seven challenges four battle pass challenges and three like normal challenges for free pass users so right now we have completed eight weeks which means seven challenges multiplied by eight which brings us to 56 weekly challenges but if you go down to the snowfall skin challenges in on that tab you're gonna see 60 challenges which means we need to complete four more challenges to get the snowfall skin yes ladies and gentlemen for this one the things have been delayed to the beginning of week 9 you need to complete four more challenges once you're done completing all the rest of the challenges from week 1 till week 8 you need to complete four more challenges to reach week 60 weekly challenges to complete the snowfall challenge now once you complete it you're gonna get like the snowfall skin yes ladies and gentlemen you're gonna get one of the rare skins which will be coming out in season 7 i mean if you are fast enough you can complete the challenges and can have the skin before your friends so, before we go any further into this video, make sure you guys give this video a big like. Liking this video would show your appreciation to the hard work that we put in making all these videos. For this video, we would have a like goal of 151 likes. 151 likes. It's very simple, very easy. If you can just go down there, smash the like goal, it would really mean the world to me. And also, we are very close to 200. Thousand subscribers and you can let that happen for our channel you can smash that subscription goal that we have which is 200,000 subscribers for this channel so go down there what are you waiting for subscribe to the channel turn on the notification bell and you're not gonna regret it because we are out here with like you no know, new information new updates like you know new leaks and like you know stuff about Fortnite. if you're into all of that like yes you are you guys are here in the right channel so if I were you I would be a part of this channel so make sure to subscribe and and furthermore we are doing a massive giveaway and now you're gonna ask me like yo Tamasha what's the giveaway all about yes it's a 1060 6 GB graphics card it's an Nvidia graphics card and with that I have the redemption code to the Nvidia bundle the main skin that you're gonna get from the Nvidia bundle a redemption code once you apply the redemption code you can get a skin the Nvidia bundle the instinct skin the bag bling the glider the pickaxe and 2000 free v bucks and with those 2000 free v bucks you can get anything for yourself from the item shop any emote or like any any wrap or any skin you can get anything from the item shop yes ladies and gentlemen check out the first link which is in the description register yourself stand a chance to win it and i was super happy like when we did our first giveaway to see the smile on that person's face like you know when he won the giveaway so it was really awesome so yeah go down there register yourself stand a chance yeah uh, with that being said let's jump on to today's video so basically we all know that there's like you know, two halves of every season there's a mid-season finale and then there's like the main finale okay i don't know why i use the word finale twice there are two events in every season in season seven with the mid-season event has happened which is the ice king getting the blizzard the snowstorm into the map that's a mid-season event and now we are waiting for the final event and now we know for sure what the final event is gonna be which is a hundred percent confirmation of the snow snowfall skin also the event which will lead us to season eight yes Ladies and gentlemen, I bring to you theory with confirmation. So here's the thing. So in the beginning of like, you know, season four, five, six, seven, like it starts with like an intro and then mid-season, 
there is something cooking up to that certain season and the story behind it. For season 4, we had had the rocket launch event and then came the cube. The cube started flipping that went on through like half of the season. Next, it fused into the loot lake. Then like the loot lake was like floating up in the air like half of the season. And the next half like it was all gone and it converted into the Garden of Eden like the loot lake as we know right now. So all this, all the, all those things has been happening. It looked like mid-season event and a final season event. So right now for season 7, we have had the mid event which is the ice king getting all that snowstorm into the map now we also know the reason why he did that we are gonna get to that later so right now that is a mid-season event and the end season event is going to be really awesome so watch this video till the end to know the answer what has happened like if you guys have not watched this first and the second part of the video let me like brief it up for you guys so if you guys don't miss out on any a few days back we went to the dungeon which is at Porter Peak now once we went inside of that dungeon there was like so much snow the next day when I woke up from bed I saw I, my friend told me to check it out because the snow has melted and like parts of the snowfall skin was visible his hands and everything so I went down there and I confirmed it by myself I was like yo like this is cool man like I'm able to see the snowfall skin till is like in a, a four arms but you're able to see it and that's a confirmation that the snowfall skin is going to come so I went down there and I see it for myself and like the whole ice is melting but then I went to the other side of the map thinking that there is going to be melting going on on the other side of the map but no there is no melting on any part of the map except for polar peak where the snowfall skin is let me ask you a question like what can melt snow or ice it's the heat the sun or the warmth or fire so what is the reason behind that big thing which is melting in the dungeon well yes it's a snowfall skin well hear me out what is the exact opposite of ice like something which is hot which is something warm like in a fire so there's a good possibility that there might be another king which is the fire king but now here's the here's the thing so he has started melting the ice from underneath the polar peak so right now when the snowfall skin comes out what do you guys think is he going to melt all the snow which is in the map is there going to be a final fight the, this is the end of season finale event where the ice king and the fire skin are gonna fight together this is a big thing i know ladies and gentlemen i know this sounds so amazing i will be out there like in a live streaming when that happens i know it for sure main reason in the mid season season event why did the ice king like you know used all his powers to get the blizzard and snow all over the map is to contain is to contain the prisoner now i'm using the word prisoner because of many reasons now he used that blizzard and snow to just cover everything up with snow so that everything goes back to the way he wants it to be so right now if you go down to the chair like people like you've seen like debates and in a meeting and everything people sit down and talk and there's like some sort of argument sometimes they agree on something sometimes they don't so right now if you go down to the ice castle at polar peak you're gonna see a same table where with chairs around it at the very center near the fireplace you can see the chair of the ice king because he has got the logo on his chair and there are like other elements on the other chair which means like that, that, that denotes some other kings some other elements maybe it can be wind maybe it can be like something else like like soil or something but the chair which has fallen down is the fire yes and now when that is fallen down which means like someone tried to like you know forcefully take him out of the meeting the reason the chair has fallen down and exactly underneath the meeting like where the table is there is a dungeon where like someone is being held captive as a prisoner so the possibility is like that is a person who was there in the meeting the ice king did not like what he said and he took him to the dungeon and he made him a fugitive like a captive over there and he froze him so that he can't escape it now with his special powers the fire king with his special powers is melting all the ice around him and he's trying to get back to his original state i'm pretty sure like the powers of the fire king is increasing like what do you guys think gives the comment section down below and do let me know because what i think is like the reason he's able to melt the ice because the temperatures are going up he's able to provide so much heat to the ice around him that is melting everything off even after like the ice has tried his best to get all the snow and blizzard all over the map to cover everything up to make it cool again but no it's not happening the snowfall skin is super strong it's stronger than the ice king and i'm pretty sure that in the myth in the final season event that's the reason fortnite like needs a way to get rid of all the snow at the end of the season so what better way would it be like to give powers to the snowfall skin like who can easily melt the ice or that the ice king has spread throughout the map yes i know right we are out here like when when the zombie event came like a month before i told you guys that there is going to be a zombie event which is going to come and i was right so mark my words that this is something which is going to happen in the game and you heard it first from tamasha behera 
so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed today's video and if you did so make sure you guys give this video a big like subscribe to the channel because it would would help us reach 200,000 subscribers and would really mean the world so go ahead share this video with all your friends so, so tell them about the snowfall skin which will be coming in the game and as always i'm gonna see you guys on my next video in a couple of hours so yeah goodbye and have a fantastic day ahead and check out the videos which are appearing on the screen right now goodbye and thank you so much for watching this video